gracias. Ya se han relajado un poquito, qué bueno. Porque estamos hablando de temas profundos, importantes, trascendentales y que no nos va a tocar llegar al final de este cuatrenio para que lo vean hecho realidad. Vamos de inmediato a presentar también a otro representante de esta ciudad y que también ama mucho a los dominicanos y estoy seguro que así será. Y recién electo vicegobernador de este estado de Nueva York, Brian Benjamin. Welcome. Mr. President, Abinader, and Mrs. First Lady, I am honored to be here. First of all, let me say, uh, Congressman Espaillat, you sure know how to bring us together. Thank you, Congressman Espaillat, for always being a leader for all of us, but particularly for making sure that the Dominican uh, American community uh, is respected throughout our country. You know, I. Uh, uh, have to say that the senator, the senior senator, Senator Majority, senator majority of Chuck Schumer, stole my whole speech. <laughs> but that's okay, because I've always got something in the back pocket, you know. Um, first of all, let me say uh, greetings from Governor Kathy Hochul. She wished she could have been here, but she sent me in her place because she wanted to make sure that you know that New York is your home as well. Your home away from home. is a state with the largest amount of Dominicans outside of the Dominican Republic. And so it is important that you know that whatever you need from the state of New York, we will be here for you. <laughs> Let me say on a personal note, I look at this room full of beautiful Dominicans, and I say to myself, as an African American, it is so important that we, communities of color, stick together. Yeah. There are those, Mr. President, who will look to divide us for their own gain. But it is important that we know that we are family. Whether you are from the Dominican Republic, or you're from Haiti, or you're from the Caribbean, where we are brothers and sisters in the struggle for equality and justice. It is important that the Dominican community here in New York succeeds financially because that is what helps you succeed back at home. If we are dying in New York from COVID, that hurts you back at home. And we are all in this together. And so let me just say, as I take my seat, the state of New York is proud to know that we have so many beautiful, I think the number was close to the two million, I don't know the number, um, but this is, a, this is a state that loves everyone. And I want you to know, as long as Governor Kathy Hochul and I, as your Lieutenant Governor, are in office, the Dominican American community will be safe, will have all the support it needs, and we will continue to grow all of us together. All of us together, all of us as one. Thank you very much. Si quieres recibir nuestro programa, solo tienes que suscribirte a nuestro canal en YouTube. Dale a la campanita y recibirás notificaciones de nuestra programación. Todos a disfrutar entre líderes.